Okay, welcome to another episode of uh, Make Block. Uh, I'm using about two program using Python editor, and uh, this particular sessions I'm planning to create a basic program, uh, which is uh, when you press a key, the robot should move forward uh, till it detect obstacle. So if it is detect obstacle, then it should avoid obstacle and move to a different directions. So when you press another button, it's supposed to stop all the actions and uh, and complete what it does. So that's the plan. Uh, let's start doing it. Uh, the first thing is let's import. Let's import libraries. Uh, I'm using here mbuild library. And also I'm importing uh, I'm using here mbot2, so I'm importing mbot2 library. Also, I'm importing events library because I'm using keypress event, which is allow me to activate a, uh, oh, sorry, import event. Uh, and also, I'm going to import uh, time because I'm allow I'm allowing a delay. Then I'm going to import time, which is the board. So let's put a hashtag and cut in this one and uh, import in. Libraries. Right. So next thing is when you think about the event. So here I'm using at event dot is press. So that means button is press. Let's press uh, button A. So it allows you to press A and then start the event. So what will happen in the event? Uh, let's put a comment before we move forward. So this is to uh, keep this event. So then uh, so what will happen is let's call a function depth. Uh, the function you can give any name. I'm giving here button on button A press. So that means when you press A. So, and I'm not passing any parameters at the moment. So let's put the colon. It's supposed to be deficit. Yeah. So, so that's better. So you can see the alignments uh, started. So then uh, we could we could start a while loop, uh, which is open while loop while through. Uh, this function should uh, do. So let me put this is a while loop or loop. Then uh, why it does is uh, while true. Let me just do like this while true. Let me later put the commits. Um, when the while loop is active, what we should do is we should check the whether there is obstacle. To check, we can kind of we can have a condition if m build uh, dot ultrasonic is the sensor we can use ultrasonic uh, to dot get and uh, index one. We can use ultrasonic. Uh, there are many indexes we can use. We can learn these ones in another episode. Uh, is less than fifteen, so that means it will detect whether the obstacle is uh, uh, away from fifteen centimeters or closer to fifteen centimeters. But if it is closer. Uh, or less than 15 centimeter. So what it should do is it should move M bot. Uh, so let's say it's move M bot 
two dot. You're going to turn this one. Uh, turn. Uh, you could turn to any direction. See, I'm going to use uh, minus 90 degree, but you can use the positive as well. That's not a problem. So it's a, either left turn or right turn. So um, else we're going to open a uh, condition. What you what you're gonna do is else mean there's no obstacle in that case M two, which is my robot, should move forward. Uh, I can when I move forward, I could give a speed, um could give uh sort of a value to the speed here. I'm going to give around 30 or 40, it doesn't matter. Um uh, so you could slow move yeah, I can control actually. So let me take it out this one. Uh, anything else you want to do? Uh, yes, we can uh, give a wait function before we start uh, to check again uh, the condition. So we're going to say time, sleep, how much you're going to sleep is, uh, let's say 0 0.1, uh, 0 0.1 second time. So. So at the time, actually, what will happen is Mbot should uh, move forward without any detection, 0 0.1. So Jimmy, I'm here moving roughly around uh, three centimeters forward, which is not much. So uh, no harm because we have detected already 15 centimeter distance. So then uh, that event is over. Uh, so let me go back to the main route. So here yeah, I'll open another event to stop this whole function. Otherwise, this will keep moving them both forward and and check the whether there is obstacle. If there is obstacle, it's going to turn. Then it's going to move forward again. So let's give a little bit of uh, hashtags. Uh, so what it does. So here we can give hashtag for a uh, key press. When, uh, um, sorry, um, our key press, key press function. So when a key press only this function is going to act till what is the key we are going to press is, we're going to press A, then you got the, the function is going to active. Then uh, here we do have a loop. So let's put a hashtag saying loop, this is a loop. So here we do have a condition. So let's put a hashtag saying uh, condition. Give a space here and it's nice. Uh, then now what happens is if it is less than what is happening is uh, should uh, robot should turn. turn. Uh, else is another condition. So else, what you need to do is uh, robot should to forward. You can give any comments, reasonable comments. So here uh, is the is the delay. delay. Then I'm going to start another event. The event is uh, at event of what. At event is pressed. At event is press of what? Press of uh, let's put uh, button B. So when a button B pressed uh, in the cyber pie, so I does uh, is we call a function. A function is on button on button pressed function happen when uh, when a button is pressed so there's no parameters in the function uh, what we could do is uh, we could do, we could stop all activities or we could simply cyber pi uh, we could really start the cyber pi um well, it's a mid functions i'm calling here so let's put some hashtag here. Uh, the first hashtag is um, another uh, event function. Uh, event. Uh, uh, here we're going to have uh, a function. Function uh, of 
press E press B, E press E. Uh, so key press function of A is better. So that's all uh, about the programs. So we could connect uh, the input and uh, test it and see. So let me know what's going on. Uh, if there is any issues, uh, uh, please put comments uh, so we could uh, work it out, all, all of these things. So I'm going to see you in the next episode uh, of recapping what we have done in the initial years and looking at uh, uh, how this could work. And then also are going to refine furthermore of what we have done. So thank you for listening. You guys uh, take care um, and see you later. Bye-bye.